Hello guys, and I hope that you are doing very well. This is my first video in the channel and uh, I created this channel to talk about educational stuff, life, motivation, gaming, a lot of different educational topics. And it was like, man, listen, these gaming channels over here about Valorant, they just clips and music, clips and music. Well, I can listen to music anywhere, you know, but it would be amazing to watch some Valorant clips, enjoy some gaming, and at the same time learn something new. So I was like, all right, let's go. So uh, today's topic, it's going to be how gaming affected my life. You know, it really affected, it really did. I'm like not the same person I was the first day I started gaming. I learned a lot of things about gaming, about the world of gaming, esports, and I learned a lot of things about myself and other cultures. So I do think it affected me both positively and negatively, and we'll go through that. So first of all, all of you, not all of you, like most of you, when you play games, you all just like, it's either for fun, mostly for fun, but also some people have objectives you know like you have goals you have dreams some someone might become a content creator get some cash on twitch youtube and instagram and tiktok and also all the social media channels and some guys want to be pro you know they want to go pro on esports it's a growing sports it's right now in college uh, there are tuitions for it there are a lot of things going on that are very very good for esports and i think that's a good path that you can take but uh what i really recommend before is to learn how uh, like the life of pro gamers you gotta learn about that bro like for getting to something that you wouldn't be able to live and the uh, content creation is amazing you know i like i love content creation i create content and yeah basically that's what i'm doing right now with Valorant. and some others want to become coaches like they see the game differently they see the game from another angle they can help other people learn about it and i think in an aspect of what i'm, of what I'm doing i want to become a coach i might become a coach in valorant who knows right now i'm just talking about different stuff in life i'm gonna talk about gaming i'm gonna talk about some lifestyles i'm gonna talk about some motivational stuff i'm gonna talk about stress management talk about well, you're gonna see, and I hope that you uh, subscribe and like and share with your friends. All right, so now talking about gaming, how it affected me. First, let me talk about the positive stuff, then we go negative. Positive? Well, man, I made a lot of friends. Holy, <laughs> they're my brothers right now. I cannot lie, man. Like, some of them know my deepest secrets right now. And it's just uh, just amazing to meet different people from different world, from different countries, you know? Like, amazing. I know now brothers from Algeria, I know brothers from Germany, France, you know, just different countries and we really vibe and we really learn a lot about each other and a lot about our cultures, you know, so it's amazing. Second thing, which is about myself, I learned that I am a very, very competitive person, man. I hate to lose. Obviously, everybody hates to lose, but I really, really hate to lose. <laughs> it's like I'm playing unranked, I'm playing Spike Crush, I'm playing a death match. I fucking hate to lose, bro. Just no, no, I hate to lose. So, with that comes stress, with that comes a lot of anger, that a lot of things. So, with time on my journey, I just learned how to control that. But sometimes, man, slowly, y'all know, y'all know what happens with the FKs and the toxic and that shit. You know, you just cannot handle it sometimes. And what I learned too is that your psychology, your mental, really affects your game. It really does affect your gaming. It really does. So I hope y'all know this. Negatively, well, it's all about actually the stress and the anger and also the time man i'm losing a lot of time i might i fucked up my sleep schedule just because i could game and just forget about life stress and shit you know but i'm looking at it the bright way that i can do something with this like i can create a youtube channel like what i'm doing right now i can just become a coach i can learn a lot about the game you know i can do things and also i benefit from what i've already said before so yeah at the bright side it's not actually time lost you know but 
it really can interfere with your life so you know man just you gotta control that shit i'm not saying that i do control that shit but i want to you know i just i want to control my time because it's really affecting it and yeah <clears throat> esports bro i started watching um uh, bro games man <laughs> i was a football fan i really was an addict and addicted really to football games and i'm like right now i don't really watch much football you know gaming uh gaming championships are not like every month but i do watch a lot of twitch <laughs> you know i don't know why but just um i love this shit you know it's an it's a community that i'm discovering like i didn't start gaming like like this until i'm 20 probably 20 one or 22 i think 21 i think 21 but before that i really just did not play games i was mostly focused on my studies and shit i was the nerd you know yeah the funny nerd you can say or not sure if i'm funny but yeah the funny nerd actually so now that i'm gaming man this world amazes me you know it just amazes me it's so different a lot of people a lot of different ideas personalities languages just yeah i love gaming so much and i really i really want this sport if i might say or this activity or whatever that it becomes really really widely popular even more than it is today you know because it, it's really good it can teach people a lot of things just like football can teach you a lot about physical uh, shape a lot about uh, stress management and all that shit well you can do that with gaming too man you can do that with gaming it's more mental more mental than it is physical you know it's more mental than it is physical it can affect you in a lot of ways so i think i really wish that gaming gets what it deserves and uh, from what i'm seeing it is really getting it it's really getting the light it's really uh, getting a lot of a good good like uh, attention you know from governments from yeah from people also yeah i really i really do like it so yeah this is the end of our video if you liked it if you like what i talked about if you share the same ideas as me if you can share with us your journey through gaming you know i would really appreciate it and uh, tell me like what would you like me to talk about uh, in the next videos and yeah subscribe like comment and peace out this is nabrainy